What's going on, Halloween hunters? We're back. Lowe's 2023 Halloween has just come out at this location. They were putting it out last night. So let's go ahead in and see what we can find. Man, they got pretty much everything. Already purchased the grave digger. Um, as you know, if you've watched my channel, these tombstones are really nice. They are $50 each. These blobs are really nice. I'm thinking about getting this one. They have the full setup here. All the big ones are up, which is really cool. Got two of them in the box. These, this is a really cool vintage looking blow mold. A little cat. They've got all the big ones out. Now this one, the groundbreaking giant zombie. What is it? Pretty crazy. This thing is huge. He is freaking massive in person. Like some of the pneumatics. You yeah, have the compressor running with a triple on it to run all three of these. Man, it's a lot of work to set all this up. I really like these guys. And I like these ones too. Which are displayed right here. Only thing is, don't know. This one's not working. I think I'm gonna get the small ones because I'm never really going to use any kind of lights like that, but there's a few more Haunted Mansion things they haven't put out yet, but they're actually putting Halloween out right now as we speak. He's putting out the very hard to find blow molds. Tons of blow ups. It's crazy how many blow ups they have. I'm just loading up all the blow molds right now. Should we hit some other of these? Oh, the witch. Dang, a lot of movement actually on this one. It's pretty cool. I think I, I actually do really like the scarecrow. Not sure if I'm gonna buy anything right now, but I don't know, those blow molds are enticing. 
Well, guys, I think that's going to be it for today. I think all they have left to put out is some skulls and stuff. There's a few Haunted Mansion pieces that are missing, but I'm sure they'll get those later. And uh, I got my tombstone. I got those little leather face lights, the small ones, because they're pretty sick. And, uh, yeah. That is going to do it. This archway is really cool too. It's $200, $220. It says Hollow, Halloween Manor. It's pretty cool. They got tons of pumpkins again. That dope pumpkin spider thing. All right guys, let's jump back in the car. guys back in Lucille the 1970 hearse and we're heading on out I gotta say Lowe's has really stepped it up every year the past like four years three or four years they've been stepping it up and they're really are competing with Home Depot now um, for a long time Home Depot always had the best Halloween and uh, Lowe's was always kind of mediocre and I think it's just because they would they weren't trying but Halloween is just growing and growing in popularity every year. In the past, like, three to four years, home, uh, Lowe's has really decided to step it up and compete. Oh, my God, there's so much traffic. With Home Depot. And uh, they're doing a good job. Um, they're coming out with tons of giant things, which is the end thing now. The giant props. And, uh, and coming out with the stuff early, like... They never come out with stuff this early. It's um, August 14th today. Or 13th. August 13th. They never come out with stuff this early. So that's going to be it for this video, guys. Thanks for coming along this little journey to, to Lowe's. Um, uh, we'll cut to the next clip. And I'll show you guys what I picked up. Alrighty, guys. So here's my pickups. Got this beautiful custom made by Deadly Night Shades. Find them on Instagram. They make the most beautiful lampshades. This is the second one they've made for me. Haunted Mansion inspired. It's gorgeous. Finally got the Mickey Giant Blow Mold Pumpkin. After not being able to find one last year. But it's okay because this year's is actually better. The lighting effect in it is way better. Also, I like the tag. They're, all of Disney's Halloween this year is better. Um, here's the one we just bought right now at Lowe's to go with my other one. This is the talking one from last year at Lowe's. Serpents and spiders, tail of a rat. Which they did not bring back this year, surprisingly. And I did buy the Texas Chainsaw Massacre lights. I did buy these ones. I think I have some Jason ones somewhere. But, yep. And then I've got the Haunted Mansion bust for this year. Got this one last year. So I completed the set on that. Found that at Spirit, which we will make a video later. And then I got this Haunted Mansion top hat. This is from the late 2000s. Um, I remember seeing it as a kid. Found this at the swap meet for 20 bucks. And um, they go for about 100 to 150 is what they're worth. So it was very random to find that. I think those are all my recent pickups. So we got those today, that today. I have another Haunted Mansion tombstone from Spirit from last year. I don't know where it is. And Lowe's was supposed to come out with another Madame Leota one this year, but it didn't move its mouth. It was cheaper. It was like $70. This one was 130 last year came out with a new one that was a little bit more aged looking but doesn't talk um, I think it still makes the sounds but it just doesn't move her mouth something like that but I haven't seen that in stores yet so that's it for right now and then for anybody interested I also picked up these at an estate sale
original Silence of the Lambs, and The Exorcist Horror. Pretty cool to add to my horror movie VHSs. I actually got a ton more, but I gave them to our friend uh, Tammy, who runs the horror salon, because she displays a bunch of those in there. So I gave her a bunch of them. So that's it for right now, guys. We'll catch you soon. Summer Spook Nights is in one week, the 19th. August 19th, if you guys, because this is going up tomorrow. So August 19th, this Saturday, if you guys want to see a bunch of hearses, spooky vendors at a really cool winery, the Rancho Cucamonga Winery, Summer Spook Nights is August 19th. Look it up, Summer Spook Nights on Instagram and Facebook and Google and come hang out. It's a free event and just enjoy having fun with a bunch of spooky people. I'll be there with the hearse, so... See you guys next time.